Ever feel stuck in an app? Like you signed up for something that seemed helpful, but now it just won't let go? Yeah, me too. That's exactly what happened with Credit Genie. It promised to be a financial lifeline, but those monthly fees started feeling more like an anchor. So, if you're nodding your head right now, wondering how to ditch Credit Genie, then this video is for you. We'll be diving deep into canceling your account, but before we do, let's take a quick rewind. What is Credit Genie anyway? For those unfamiliar, Credit Genie offers cash advances. It seems okay on the surface, a small sum to hold you over until payday. But here's the catch, there's a monthly fee to keep your account active, even if you don't use it. And that's where things get frustrating. Those fees can sneak up on you, eating away at your budget. Plus, some reviews online mention difficulties canceling altogether. Yikes. All right, enough talk. Let's cancel this thing. Now, the good news is that canceling Credit Genie is possible. It might take a few steps, but we'll break it down for you. Step 1. Disconnect your bank account. This is crucial. First things first, you need to cut off Credit Genie's access to your hard-earned cash. Here's how to do it. Open the Credit Genie app. Navigate to the Settings section. It might be a gear icon or tucked away in your profile menu. Look for an option like Linked Accounts or Bank Accounts. Once you find it, there should be a way to disconnect or delete your bank account. Important note, some users report that this option is grayed out if you have an outstanding balance. Don't worry, we'll address that in a moment. Step 2. Repay any outstanding advances, if applicable. If you have a cash advance you haven't paid back yet, you'll need to settle that before fully canceling your account. Credit Genie won't let you disconnect your bank account until the balance is zero. Step 3. Request account deactivation. The final blow. Once your bank account is disconnected and any advances are repaid, it's time to say goodbye. Here are two ways to deactivate your Credit Genie account. Through the app, look for a Contact Us or Help Center section within the app. There might be an option to submit a request for account deactivation. Direct email. If the app doesn't offer an easy way to deactivate, you can try emailing Credit Genie's customer support directly. Their email address should be listed somewhere in the app or on their website. In your email, be clear and concise. State your request to deactivate your account and include your account information for reference. Bonus tip, consider following up. While Credit Genie claims to process deactivation requests promptly, it never hurts to be cautious. Send a follow-up email a few days later if you don't hear back. Double check for recurring charges. Finally, after you've requested deactivation, keep an eye on your bank statement for a month or two. Make sure there aren't any more debits from Credit Genie. Congratulations! You're, hopefully, free. By following these steps, you should be successfully free of Credit Genie. Remember, if you encounter any issues during the cancellation process, don't hesitate to reach out to their customer support and be persistent. Closing thoughts. There you have it. Hopefully, this video has empowered you to take control of your finances and ditch Credit Genie for good. Remember, always be mindful of app permissions and recurring fees before signing up for any service. That's all for today. Thanks for watching and until next time.